a brand new video on the channel. Now in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I got a thousand views per day on YouTube, on all of my channels. Now this video is not clickbait. I'm gonna be telling you how I've grown every channel of mine over the past five years. I have stats from channels that I had back in 2012 and I use the same strategy to grow them and I've been using the same strategy and it's been working really well for me so I thought I'd share it with you guys. It's one of the tricks I use and I thought it could help you guys out. Now before we begin, if you guys wanna see more videos like this, be sure to leave a like down below. And with that being said, let's get started. Now, I'm gonna try to keep this video as uncut as possible. If you guys do like that, let me know down below in the comments. But the first thing I'm going to do is show you guys my older channels all the way back from 2012. So yeah, I've been doing YouTube for a really long time. And I think it's important to show you guys because I wanna show you guys like how far not only have I come, but like how interesting it was and how I've been using the same strategy no matter how different the channels were. But each channel has managed to grow a good amount in my opinion, even though I was like 12 years old. So this is my first channel, it was called Uxoy. And if you guys can notice, I've kept the same, like, I name my channels the same way. I just pick really weird names that are really, you know, abstract and they sound cool and they're catchy. So the first channel is called Uxoy. And I made this channel back in 2012. So I was 12 years old. And yeah, so I was 12 and I was making videos. And this channel was about something called people are awesome so if you guys don't know people are awesome is like a type of videos people used to make i don't know if they still make them but you would get like talent from around like all of youtube you get really cool talent videos and you would put them all together and you would make like a compilation of them and you would post them and people would watch them because it's a bunch of things that show how people are awesome so that was my first channel and as you can see the latest it goes up to is about october of 2012 so even then, I was consistently averaging about a thousand views per day. And I actually closed this channel because I was, I think, I don't even know, I was turning 13, you know, big things are going on in my life. But my second channel was called Crash Tages. Now, this was also my channel. And basically, this channel was a car crash compilation channel. I don't know, I was into cars and I thought, you know, it'd be cool if you could film, you know, cars and dash cams are becoming really popular. So on this channel, I would take car crash videos or just really like insane crashes or car videos and put them together. And if you guys look at the views, this channel I can still access. It's 20,000 views, 5,000 views, 16,000 views, 670,000 views. And the reason the views vary is because uh, the method, which is gonna be using Reddit, it actually varies how popular each post gets. So different videos would get different amounts of views. Now this channel I gave to my friend so I can't actually log in, but I can still show you guys the videos and you guys can still check it out if you want. Now I also had a third channel and it was a lyric video channel and I had one video on there that had I think 11 million views before I got copyright striked. I wish I still had that channel, but I can't show you guys that one. That was another channel I had. But regardless, those are the channels I've had in the past. Now the way I grew all of these channels is the exact same, including Zyovo. I used a website known as Reddit. So if you go on reddit.com, you guys can see Reddit is basically a forum site. I'm pretty sure you all know what Reddit is, but it's not just about using Reddit because a lot of people talk about using Reddit. It's how you use it. There's different strategies and different ways you can actually grow using Reddit. Now, of course, what you have to do is make a Reddit account and then you submit a new link or a text post. And basically Reddit has something called subreddits, which is basically categories. And what a lot of people do is they go on, you know, slash r slash YouTube which is a YouTube subreddit, or they go on r slash videos. And if you guys go on these subreddits, you'll see people are just submitting videos. And yes, they get very popular. If you submit something on here and it blows up, you're gonna get millions of views right off the bat because this post, for example, has 48,000 likes or upvotes. And if you click on it, the actual video is on Twitch, but it has over 800,000 plays. So I mean, if you have a really, really niche video that can go viral and you know it can, this is a good place to put it. But personally, I don't think you should be putting videos on r slash videos. I know that sounds very ironic, but the reason is if you put videos on here and you share them, there's so many people on this thread that it is very unlikely your video is going to get put on the front page. And not only that, if you put it on r slash videos, your target audience, yes, it is 16 million subscribers, but your target audience is also going to be a bunch of different kinds of people. And what this means is basically, 
not a lot of people are going to click on it because, for example, this is a compilation of British drivers swearing. I don't know how many people would be interested in that, but if you found something more targeted, you'll have a better chance of having people watch it. And those viewers are going to be quality viewers. So these are the people that actually have an interest in seeing what you post. So for example, with this car crash channel, what I would do is I would not post on r slash videos. We can close that out, but I would uh, post on a subreddit called car crash. And this subreddit only has 20,000 subscribers. And I'd also post on Roadcam, and this one has 200,000 subscribers. But as you can see, the top posts only have like 40, 50 likes. This one has 20, this one has 13. And on this subreddit, the top posts have like five or six likes. Now, what this means is if I put my video on here, a car crash video on a subreddit called car crash, a lot of people will be interested in it simply because the people on this page are interested in car crashes. It won't be that hard to get five or six upvotes on my video. And just by doing that, I'll be on the front page of this subreddit. Now, this is what I would do. I would literally, I'll go onto my old Reddit account. I would literally post these car crash videos of mine onto these subreddits. So for example, you can see Honda Civic hits tire and flips over at really slow speeds. This was a video I submitted to r slash roadcam. And if I click on it, it has 136 upvotes and it has 38 comments. So this was like the number one post for this subreddit. If I got 100 likes on r slash videos, it wouldn't make a difference because those ones have like 40,000 likes. I got 100 likes and this was the number one post. And if you look at the video, it got 14,000 views. So if I was to make a video every day, which I did on this channel, it would pass 1,000 views and I would be getting 1,000 views per day. Now, if you go on to some other videos, for example, such as, uh, let's find one that doesn't have as many votes. So these car crashes are crazy. Uh, it's on r slash car crash. So this Reddit page has 18,000 subscribers. So it's very small. But if I click on it, the video itself did much better. It got 23,000 views. And yeah, so <laughs> for a channel that has no one on it before, for being like 14 years old and making random videos and not telling anyone about this channel, I wasn't big or anything. 23,000 views from a Reddit post is really good. And if you go on the stats of this video, for example, I can do this with all of my videos. You can see that there was a spike. So all, this whole spike just comes from Reddit, being on the Reddit page. And then everything else is a gradual increase because once I got those views from Reddit, you know, if you get a lot of views at once, YouTube puts your video in the recommending section or the trending section of other pages, and then you'll slowly start to gain more views. So that's what I did. I would just post on Reddit and this is all the proof you have it here. Now, I would keep doing this and every single video would consistently get thousands of views. As you can see, there's no video that had under a thousand views. Uh, the lowest one was like one or 2000 and some videos would do so well, they'd have like a hundred thousand or like 200,000. So I found that road rage videos did really well. So I would make more of those. And yeah, this channel did great. Like in a few weeks, it had over a million views and I did this just by posting on Reddit. Now, if you guys want to apply this to your own videos, the tips I have are pretty simple. You want to go for the smaller subreddits. So for example, say you play League of Legends, you could post in the League of Legends subreddit. But as you can see, these posts are getting like 600, 900 likes. Getting that many likes will be really hard and it will be hard to be on the first page. Instead, what you can do is look at the related subreddits and these are smaller ones. So for example, there's a character in this video game called Fizz. So I can go on the Fizz subreddit and this one only has 2000 subscribers and getting on the first page, literally everyone gets on it. It means you need to get three or four likes, but once you're on the first page, you're in front of an audience that actually wants to watch your videos, which is why it'll do so much better on these smaller subreddits. Now, my second tip is just like a personal recommendation and it's make sure your Reddit username is not the same as your YouTube username. I mean, you are self promoting, but if people see your name on both, it makes it very obvious. And I don't think that leaves off a good impression. And also another tip I have is that when you're posting, make your titles interesting because everyone can see the thumbnail. And if you go back to the Let's do on, let's do road cam. If you go back to one of my older subreddits that I would post on, every single thumbnail looks the same. What you want to do is make your title look appealing. Don't just do car crash video. You have to do something like car crashes into median to avoid hitting news van. Like that sounds interesting. So make sure the titles are interesting and you obviously follow the guidelines. And if you don't like Reddit, you can also go on other forums. So that's another tip I have. You can go on something such as YT talk. But the thing is, like Reddit is a forum. You can do the same thing I taught you on any forum. 
And when I say go on forums, what a lot of people do is they go onto YouTube forums right away. You don't have to do that. There's millions of forums on the internet. And another tip I have to consistently getting a lot of views is to post on different forums. If you go on this forum, for example, everyone's going to be posting YouTube videos and that means your video is going to get pushed down to the bottom unless it's really cool and you're not going to get that many views. If you make gaming videos, go on gaming forums and post them. If you make hardware videos or computer videos, go on a computer forum and then post there. Not only are you going to be, you know, getting those views, but you're also targeting a better audience that's more selective, that actually likes watching what you're posting. So yeah, that is my big secret. That's what I've been doing for the past five almost six years on youtube to be you know growing my channel and i mean i've been doing it since i was 12 which means you can do it as well but that's about it for this video guys sorry if it was very rambly i just wanted to you know make it very informative but that's about it if you guys like this video be sure to give it a big thumbs up and as always thanks for watching my name is iovo and i'm sunny